Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another video. I hope you're well. I hope you're having a good day. Um, if you're new around here, feel free to subscribe. It would help. Drop me a like on the video as well. I'm going to Sudbury in Suffolk today, and I think this might be about the hardest game of cricket that I play in all year. I've made it to Sudbury. This place looks incredible, doesn't it? Like in the middle of town. Um, it's gonna be 150 people here having lunch today. I don't know whether they're gonna watch any of the cricket or not, but I mean, if they haven't, of course, they can um, they can watch the video afterwards, can't they? And watch me schneck off for nothing. Well, to be fair, that is reliant on me even hitting it. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. It's a really pretty little place. The pavilion just over my right shoulder. That's been there. They've got photos in there from like 1905 when they've been playing cricket. Yeah, I'll keep you posted. Oh, and by the way, I'll go and have a look at the pitch in a minute because that's what all village cricketers do, isn't it? Go look at the pitch. You don't know what any of it means. It's 22 yards. It's got some green stuff on it, some white paint, some sticks at either end. But um, it seems to be the done thing, doesn't it? Go have a, have a look at the pitch. Yeah, go on, lads. Have a look at the pitch. There's the pitch. Looks nice, doesn't it? Bit of green. Told you there'd be some green on it because that's what there is on every cricket pitch. Um, fairly short boundaries. And then like the reason why I'm here today, Dustin Malton used to play professional cricket with Derbyshire. He's put together a team to come down and play as part of Sudbury's Cricket Week. I got told there's like five players here that play for Suffolk in minor county stuff. So yeah, that might be where I kind of mentioned about it being one of the hardest games of the year for me. But we'll give it a go. We'll run around and we'll try hard, won't we? And just like that, we had won the toss, we were batting first, and I found myself in a team with a handful of first-class cricketers. Yeah, good luck. Well batting, mate. Cheers. This is Ahmed Bashir. A first class cricketer for Southern Punjab in Pakistan. Hi hey, mate, and how you doing? He opens the bowling with Mohammed Abbas. Anything going on? Maybe inside. Yeah? yeah? Okay, fantastic. Come on, lads, how are you? Is that middle, please, umpire? A bit more? Thank you. Thank you very much. All good? Yeah. Nice. Good. How about the guy? His leggy's from the other end, isn't it? Yeah, leggy. Yeah? Yeah, yeah? Okay, cool. Change your bowler, still right on him, over. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh! Does that look like middle? Is that middle, sir? Thank you. Come on, lads, stop it. Ready. One more before lunch. Come Ready. Ready. Oh dear. Yep. Oh, he's, he's not got a pair on camera. <laughs> Is there sound as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. We have to look like we're trying. I'll bleep it out if you swear, don't worry. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you? Yeah, not too bad. Actually, yeah. Glad I've got more. Right on, no run. Well, Ben. This probably doesn't bowl either. It'll be good enough for me, don't you worry. Sorry mate, that was my call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I apologise. Yeah. yeah, he looked good. I'm quite pleased the first one was outside my off stump. How you doing? I'm okay. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh. No Oh, 
Show me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Show me. You've got to stand here and as Rishi comes in, just a bit like. Well, just try and leave. Well, so when we've got some DRS to go back to. Yeah. yeah. It might take a while to get it through back to the camera. Get on, yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff, mate. Keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, he's um, getting into town, isn't he? <laughs> yeah. Wait on. Ah. So. Oh well. A future Dan here. Um, honest conversation with regards to these GoPro videos and I must admit I do find them a little bit of a struggle. I think part of me part of me struggles with needing or, or kind of having to make a video from these pieces of content so once I've kind of got the GoPro on and I mean the easy part of it is is remembering to charge the batteries put the camera on the helmet and press the button like that bit's easy hey, I can do that that that's well within my well within my pay grade. What I find quite taxing is the difficulty between needing to kind of bat for long enough to make sure that you get like a, an eight to 10 minute video. Um, you know what's funny though, is I'm not actually kind of watching, I'm not batting out there thinking, oh, I have to score 30, 40, 50, because um, otherwise everybody watching the video is gonna think that I'm rubbish. I mean, most people watching the videos think that I'm pretty crap anyway. So I don't think um, kind of a low score here or there is gonna make a great deal of difference because like in this in this example, um, I kept for the last kind of 20, 25, maybe 30 overs or something. And because I'd had that low score and because I would kind of thought, oh, it just hasn't gone particularly well, I didn't put the GoPro on my helmet for when I kept wicket. So we missed a catch, we missed a, we missed a chance for a stumping, um, we missed obviously the, the chat and the bowling whilst, the, whilst that kind of second innings was going on as well. So yeah, let me know what you think on, on these kind of videos. I quite like them being a bit, a bit more vloggy, if that makes sense, rather than just pure GoPro. But again, let me know your thoughts. My plan for the rest of the summer, for the friendlies that I play anyway, is to wear the GoPro, take the camera, make a bit of a video, almost a video documentary of the friendly games, whether it's a Sunday, whether there's an opportunity to play in midweek. So if there are some games coming up and you're after a player, let me know. And we'll kind of see how it goes from there, really. Um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed it. There is a Patreon now, I've set that up. There's a link in the description of the video. If you'd like to check it out, that'd be cool. There's some stuff in there like giveaways and bat stickers and Cricket 22 content and things. But if not, I will see you for another video with the GoPro on my head. Get it on the field. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. Unfortunately. Yeah.